Good morning, fam. Welcome to Elbow Cove, Dominican Republic. Elbow Cove is a beautiful 25-acre cruise port owned by Carnival Cruise Line. This $85 million port opened in 2015. Want to see what all it has to offer? Let's go. This port also offers some of the best excursions in the region, such as the waterfalls of Rio de Damajagua, zip lining, swimming with the dolphins, ATV adventures, water sports, and beautiful beaches. This area was also used to film Steven Spielberg's Oscar-winning movie Jurassic Park back in 1993. But before we head out, let's grab a bite to eat. All right, guys, let's see what we have on the buffet today. Beer batter fish, shrimp and chicken rice, sweet and sour pork, black bean and pumpkin enchiladas, Tex-Mex noodle casserole, some green spinach. Hmm. See if we got the same thing on the other side. No, it looks like something different on this side. Chipotle lime chicken, potatoes, smothered squash, and some more spinach. All right, guys, we are headed off the ship and time to do a little exploring of Amber Cove. We just visited Amber Cove a couple of months ago and we went to Ocean World, which is awesome. So if you ever come to Amber Cove, be sure to visit Ocean World. Um, you can check out that video hit the box at the top of the screen. But today we're just gonna probably do a little shopping, maybe hang out by the pool. Just a relaxation day today in Amber Cove. Oh, Enjoy my great service to my beautiful island. Enjoy the view, my friend. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. This transportation from the cruise ship to the port area is free of charge, but they do expect for you to leave them a tip. Guys, we are in beautiful Amber Cove. As you can see, the beautiful celebration in the background, which is a gorgeous ship, Carnival's brand new flagship. And this is your duty-free shop, guys. If you wanna get some alcohol to take back to the ship, And this is where you will meet up for your, all your excursions. If you did have an excursion book, guys, this would be the area. And they do have different zones. You have zone one over there. You have zone two. So you will be instructed on which zone to go and wait for for your excursions. And they have all your typical port shops, the Diamond Internationals. You have a cafe there. You have your Effie store. Pretty much all the basic shops that you will find at all the cruise ports. 
Y'all, the temperature says that it's 79 degrees out here today, but it feels a lot hotter than 79, which is not bad. Pretty much the perfect temperature to be out and about. Amber Cove. Shark Attack gift shop, guys. Let's see what we got here. And guys, this is your taxi area if you want to catch a taxi to go explore more of Amber Cove um, or Puerto Plata. You can come here and this is where all your taxis and buses and everything will be located. Yeah. More gift shops. Like I said, if you don't want to do an excursion or just want to hang around the port, they have plenty of shopping and entertainment for you. And there is a beach area here, guys, but it is off property, so it is a paid excursion if you want to come to this beach, which is not very flattering, but <laughs> If you just have to get in the water, I guess you can pay the small amount and there's your beach. And it is a private property which you would have to pay for. And here is a gorgeous shot of the beautiful carnival celebration, guys. Simply amazing ship. The sister ship of the Mardi Gras. And like I said, there are restaurants if you want to stop and grab a bite to eat and grab a drink. This place is two stories, upstairs and downstairs.
And here is the famous Amber Cove sign, which pretty much see everyone take photos in front of with the ship in the background. Gorgeous. Fam, do me a favor, if you haven't done so already, reach down and smash that like button. If you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button. We would love to have you part of the Travel Junkie family. Got a little waterfall. Nice little touch. Here is the Amber Cove Fossil Monument. This port Amber Cove got its name because of the high amounts of amber produced in the area, which turns into stone, which is used to make all types of jewelry and other beautiful artifacts. Right guys, let's go see what's happening over by the pool today, which is normally always something going on in the pool. It's a huge pool with the DJ, Alright guys, we are headed to the Sky Bar. We're going to see if these old legs can make it up all these steps. You don't got that far, though. I know, these, these steps are tricky. Oh my God. We made it guys, made it to the top to the sky bar. And that's where you would load up to do the zip line. Alright guys, this is the view from the Sky Bar. Awesome views.
right guys that was a pretty neat experience <laughs> visiting the sky bar here in amber cove we're gonna head back to the ship guys and grab another bite to eat All right, guys, this is our second time at the buffet. <laughs> and we have some fish from sweet and sour pork, which is really good. And some sugar cookies. And I got more of the sweet and sour pork, which I must say is delicious. Right, guys we are leaving Amber Cove and headed to San Juan Puerto Rico Get guys burgers again, y'all. Y'all, we got to stop eating so much. Oh my goodness. Look at that plate. Fam, this show is by far my favorite show on board this cruise ship.
so much to laugh, I'll have to leave. And this fire's burning still. When I watch you look at me, cause I A little family feud live. Y'all, that was hilarious. If you ever own a carnival, Mardi Gras, or the celebration, you gotta check out this show. 
Guys, we have reached the end of another awesome day on board the Carnival Celebration. I hope you guys enjoyed Amber Cole just as much as I did. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And until next time, peace.